Argentina and the International Monetary Fund have struck a deal to rescue the country's embattled debt program. The agreement should unlock around $4.7 billion in funding. Economy Minister Luis Caputo spoke after the deal was reached. I want to make clear this is not a new agreement. We have relaunched the previous one, which was on hold due to the goals not being fulfilled. Agreement was urgently needed. Argentina is battling inflation heading towards 200 percent and is short of foreign currency reserves. Meanwhile, the IMF loans had been on hold after the previous government missed economic targets linked to the program. The new administration of libertarian president Javier Millet had been locked in talks with the fund since late last week. Caputo welcomed the agreement, but also said Argentina shouldn't rely on it. It's time the country solves its financial problems by solving, as I said at the beginning of this address, its structural problems, which are its addition to the excess of public expenditure and fiscal deficit, as this is what ends up generating all the problems suffered by society. For now, the IMF deal looks like a timely win for Millet, who faces daunting economic challenges. He came to power promising to cut spending, slash bureaucracy and free up business. But his program of deregulation is proving divisive on the streets and in Congress, where he lacks the majority needed to drive through reforms.